is the right-hander Taylor Widener, 26 years old, and today makes his first career start. Carson wants it down. Good spot. Great slider from Taylor Widener, and he puts Hosmer away. Swing and a miss. There's the Widener slider. There's always lessons to be learned at the major league level. I don't care how many years you've played in the big leagues. There are things to be learned on a daily basis. Ooh, another nasty slider down and in for strike three. And tonight it's the D-backs debut for 24-year-old right-hander Humberto Mejia. And that's showing a good slider. How about that? First batter, three pitches and three strikes. See you later. Called strike three, Humberto Mejia. But when did those ever mean anything? The two Pirates hits. Swing and a miss. Second time he's got Gamble. That's five strikeouts for Mejia. Rookie right-hander Matt Peacock on the mound for the Diamondbacks. Ten appearances. Career start number three. It's been pretty good. Good start for Matt Peacock. Well, your Diamondback starting pitcher tonight is the right-hander Merrill Kelly. Stripes, there's nothing on him. Just a pair of white pants. It is a clean, classic look. Well, Merrill Kelly has now struck out for the last five as we get a quick word from 72 Soul. Well, Merrill Kelly has it rolling now. He has struck out four consecutive Dodgers in five of the last six. Merrill Kelly make it eight strikeouts. Merrill Kelly's the guy that you can count on to get to five, six. Just the lefty Caleb Smith. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. Caleb Smith strikes out the side in the seventh. Wave that the breaking ball. Swing and a miss on the breaking ball. Ram truck starting pitcher for the Diamondbacks tonight, Madison Bumgarner, who has completed seven innings in each of his last three starts. Here's the curveball. He gets his first strikeout. That pitch and the straight changeup have become more and more part of his arsenal. Osmer dived at a curveball. Matt. Moves to the cutter, gets the strikeout. Well, Madison now finding that rhythm. His second strikeout, one down in the second. That's a sharp break on that curveball tonight. Center Obviously, it's his best off speed pitch. We talked about the changeup that he's played with a little. Called strike three by Chad Fairchild on the curveball. That's strikeout number four to the first nine batters for Madison Bumgarner. High breaking ball that time. They get the call from Chad Fairchild behind the plate. Right there with a 93 mile an hour fastball. He rings up Rojas. Strikeout number five for Madison. Two and two on Brian Anderson, the Marlins third baseman. Swing and a miss. There's strikeout number six. Second time he's got Anderson back to the curveball that time. Oh, he just seems to have a lot more sweep on that curveball tonight than he's had all year long. I mean, he starts that ball way off the plate and it ends up on the inner third. Right handed Luke Weaver out there tonight. He's hit safely in four straight games, five of six. 97 right by him.